So today we are going to look at how to convert text to numbers. And we're going to look at, first of all, how do you know this is a text, this is a number? How can you detect that? And after that, how do you format it? And the different ways we can use to change a text to a number. After that, we shall see how do we do the reverse into it and start with text to a number. If you see figures aligned to the left, know that this is a text and not a number. How do you know that this is a text? There are some Google Sheet functions we can use to detect that. One, you can say, is number. Now, this is number checks whether the value you give it is a number or not. If at all it is a number, it will return true. And if it is not a number, it will return false. Let's see. There you go. It returned false, meaning that this is a text, though it appears like a number. So when I drag this down, you can see false, false, false. Again, if you try to do the sum of this, you say these are numbers, let me try to sum them up. Because they are text, they give you zero. That's another way of knowing that this one is text, but not a number. Now, there's also another Google Sheet function called is text. Now, this one checks whether the value you give it is a number or text. At all, it is a text, it will return true. And if not, it will return false. Just like you see here, you can see it return false, true, meaning that these are text. So you can use either is number to check whether it's a number. If it is true, it means that it is a number. And if it is false, it means that it is not a number. Or you can use the is text function, which will check whether it is a text. If it is a text, it will say true. And if it is a number, it will show false. Now, having detected that these are not numbers, but rather text, the next issue is how do we convert them into numbers? Now, there are, I'm going to three, show you three ways of converting them. The first way is to use the format. Let me copy these over here, their text. So highlight this, go to format, number, look for a number, like so. If I try the function I tried earlier, the sum function now works. But if you try to do a mathematical operation on text, because it is text, it will say, I'm not working. However, if you convert the text into numbers, then your operation is gonna work. The next way to convert this text into a number is to use a value function. So the value function takes in a text, and our text is this one here, close brackets. When you do that, it converts it into a number. If we try a mathematical operation again, it sums it up and gives us a total like so. Another way to convert a text to a number is you can decide to multiply these numbers by one. So what Google Sheet says, understand is, hey, you're trying to do a multiplication. And if it is a multiplication, I need to convert all numbers, all text to numbers, so that I'm, I'm able to multiply them. So what it will do, it will convert this text to a number and then multiply by one. So when you do that, you can see it converts it to a number and it's aligned to the left. Again, if I apply my mathematical operation on these figures, it works fine. Now, that is how to convert text to a number. You may say, However, if I want to go the reverse, 
what we need to do now is convert numbers to text. Now, again, I'm going to show you two ways. The first way is to use the format. When I do a sum there, you can see it works fine. Now I want to convert this to text. I go to format, number, plain text. If I click there, you can see they are formatted to the left. I try a mathematical operation here, like sum. Summing text gives me zero saying you cannot sum these numbers because they are not numbers though they appear like numbers but that's why you get a zero so here remember you can use the format highlight that go to format plain text is the solution using a function there is another google sheet function called to text what this does, it takes a number like this one and converts it to a text. As you'll observe, this is aligned to the right. The moment I click there, enter, it's gonna be aligned to the left, like so, meaning that now this is no longer a number, but it is a text. Again, if I try to do a sum on this, you're gonna get zero because when you sum text, you get a zero. I hope this has been helpful. This is very important. If you try to do a sum on text, it will not work and you'll wonder why is it not working. Remember, you can check using is number or is text functions to find out that. And if you know that these are text, you can convert them using the methods I've used then it will work fine. Thank you for watching. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe. Like the video. Give me your comments. Ask me any question on this. And have a great day.